no body telling this method to upgrade to windows 11 from windows 10 or windows 11 itself like recently released windows 11 version 25s2 and in this video i will tell you the method which can upgrade to windows 11 version 25s2 very very easily and this method is not over the internet nobody telling about it this is very simple and uh, hidden trick or you have to go to windows 11 website download the iso download the installation media or installation assistant right that is very very lengthy process and this video will tell you very very easy way to upgrade to windows 11 version 25s2 for this kind of video you will not get over the internet or on youtube this is the first video is going to be on youtube so basically if you are using windows 10 windows 10 support is also going to end so i'm going to upgrade from windows 10 to 11 version 25s2 directly i don't need to download windows 11 version 24s2 or windows 10 update and all i'm going to cut them off all so just go into windows settings and if you check for update you will get here lots of uh, windows 10 update or windows 11 version 24s2 then you will get windows version 25s2 but uh, here's a very simple trick you don't need to do all these things just go and open registry you just need to copy paste this path over here and you will see here windows update here i created these kind of keys to target to windows 11 version 25s2 if you want to create by your own you can just right click and create key of windows update then in the right side you need to create these three keys like product version target release version target release version info so basically in product version you have to set windows 11 in target release you have to set a value 1 in target release version info you have to set version 25s2 and that's it so basically i have created this uh, registry if you go into edit you can see all all keys are here so basically you double click on it and it will directly install in your system and you can just go on check for update and uh, it will work for you don't need to manually go and create now it's time to check for update and you will be shocked like you can see windows 11 version 25s2 so basically if your system is supported you will see this kind of update or even not supported you will see this update but it will give you some error right so make sure you have uh, supported system you have enabled the secure boot and tpm if you don't know how to do that you can just follow the previous videos that video link i put in the description so basically you can see it is downloading or installing in this process you don't need to create bootable usb or create a local account and blah 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 all these things are going to cut from here you just need one good internet connection and after that it will do all things for you you don't need to do much thing just run that registry file and check for update and we landed into windows 11 let me show you the about section here you can see windows 11 version 25s2 and the date you can also match right so this is the power of this trick so i hope you guys understand right so currently we did not get all the feature because by default it is hidden in this version so i already told in my previous video how to get this uh, latest windows 11 start menu in task manager you can see all things are very very normal here right like 0% 152 processes and memory is around 3.3 gbs i have 8 gb here so all things are good here after that you can also delete that windows update uh, registry key and if you do not delete it your uh, windows will stuck to this version only in future if you get uh, any new feature update that is not going to pop up so make sure you are going to delete it so let me know your thoughts about this trick 